Hey guys, typical Dave here. I'm playing the Human Resource Machine, this is year 9, and I'll be showing you how to get the size and the speed challenges completed. In this one, you have to use 5 or fewer commands and then complete in 25 or fewer steps. So the first thing we're going to do is go to the inbox, create a jump, going up. What this is going to do is to start cycling through every single thing on the conveyor. Every time we find a zero, we want to outbox it. And then we're going to have to go back to the start. So while this code will work, as you can see, we are wasting turns. So take the zero, throw the six, throw the D, grab the zero. So I'll stop the code. And what I'm talking about is every time it is a zero, you can see inbox, zero, outbox, jump. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, over and over again. If we move the outbox, so we get rid of the jump, move the outbox all the way up, and then move this so it's here, you can still see it's working just fine. However, it's only three jumps. So inbox, one jump, and down to here. So one, two, three. One, two, three. So we're saving a turn on every single zero. However, we can't start on an outbox. So what we're going to do is just put a jump right at the start and tell it to skip the outbox. So we're back up to five items. However, this jump will only get used once on turn one because it's impossible for it to get back up above. So if I click play, you can see he'll throw the one away, grab the zero and go straight there. And then instantly he's back to the inbox without having to do another jump. What I'm going to do is just speed this up a bit, throw the five away, grab the zero and it's finished. Now the clipboard's up, we can see we've completed it in five or fewer commands and when it comes to the speed challenge it only took 25 out of 25. I hope you found this helpful and I'll see you around, thank you.